Hello and welcome to this Sight and Sound Technology demonstration. Today we're going to take a look at two solutions that offer easy text reading. The Smart Reader HD by Enhanced Vision and the Omni Reader by Freedom Scientific. Both products offer the ideal solution for reading magazines, books, newspapers and other documents. Both products include a built-in camera and use OCR technology to convert text into speech. Let's take a closer look at each product. The Smart Reader HD is a lightweight, portable reader scanner with large, built-in, user-friendly tactile control buttons. A fully integrated solution, the Smart Reader HD offers the advantage of a built-in HD camera and OCR, or optical character recognition. The Smart Reader HD enables individuals with low vision to retain the pleasure of reading by listening along or by attaching a monitor to view the text. Users are able to view in colour, enhanced high contrast positive or negative modes, allowing for higher contrasts and easier viewing. With easy to use buttons and dials, customers can enlarge or reduce the text in seconds and change viewing options for easier visibility. The first thing that strikes me with the Smart Reader HD is how portable and versatile it is. It's perfect for reading magazines, letters, books, newspapers and other documents. And it has a built-in 8-hour rechargeable battery. Let's turn it on and have a look at the features in greater detail. Hello, ready to scan. To begin, place your document to be scanned underneath the camera. It doesn't matter the orientation of the document, as the smart reader will automatically adjust. You can press either one of the capture buttons located on the top of the smart reader to perform an OCR scan. Tap again to return to home, ready to scan the next page. Processing. Battery charge usage time and status announcements. The document I placed under the camera was a section of the user guide referencing the battery. Using the OCR technology, this has now been read back to me quickly and accurately. On the base of the unit in the centre, there's a button that you can tap to play or pause during reading at any time. On the base of the unit, there are two buttons located towards the front on the left and the right side. These are the previous and next line buttons. By pressing the next line button, the document will be moved forward to the next line. Likewise with the previous button. Press this to move back a line at a time. Bullet two fully charged. Switch is set to one as shown. Ensure that the rear panel switch is set. We can press the OCR button again to return to home, ready to scan the next page. Ready to scan. Note that this time I have placed the document landscape, but the Smart Reader HD has been able to self-orientate. Processing. In addition to moving to the next or the previous line, we can also go to the next or previous word. We do this first by press and holding the play slash pause button. In combination, press the previous and next button to go to the previous or the next word respectively. In. Is. Is. In. Operation. On the base of the unit, there is a thumb wheel on each side. On the left side, there's a volume wheel. Rotate this to adjust the volume accordingly. Volume 5. Volume 4. On the right side, there's a thumb wheel which you can rotate to adjust the OCR speed. If the reading is too slow or too fast for you, you can adjust this to your liking. OCR speed 8. OCR speed 7. As we mentioned at the beginning, one of the top features of the Smart Reader HD is the ability to connect a HDTV or external monitor. This gives you even greater flexibility when viewing your documents, as you have a visual representation of your document. Now we're able to see the Smart Reader's field of view on the screen. So let's press the OCR button again on the top of the unit to perform a scan. The Smart Reader now processes the image just as it did before without the screen. Processing. And within just a few seconds, our document has finished processing. But now, with the monitor attached, we've unlocked some more possibilities. By pressing and holding the same button we used to go back a line or a word, in combination with the volume thumb wheel on the left side, we can control the magnification level. We can zoom in or zoom out to get to the desired setting to give you the most comfortable viewing experience. Using the same technique, 
but this time with the right side next button in combination with the right side voice speed thumb wheel. We are now able to control the colour mode. Choose your favourite colour mode from yellow on black, black on yellow, white on black, black on white, green on black, or whichever setting you find that works for you. Now let's move on and take a closer look at the Omni Reader. The Omni Reader reads printed text to you by pressing a single button. You can follow the magnified text in high contrast colours on the built in screen, or simply listen as the Omni Reader reads text out loud. You can also use the screen to instantly magnify objects and text and display them in high contrast colours to see them more clearly. Thanks to its lightweight design, built in handle and long battery life, you can pick it up and use it wherever you want, whether that be at home, at the office and even on the go. Now let's explore some of the features of the Omni Reader in more detail. Press the power button on the left hand side of the device to turn it on. After just a few short seconds, you'll land on the main menu. Files will be the first item in the list. The Omni Reader is now ready. Straight away, let's do a scan with the Omni Reader. The Omni Reader can scan and read both letter and A4 size documents. When you position a document, use the base or the bottom front of the Omni Reader as a guide. Place the document directly in front of the unit so that the short side of the paper fits within the width of the unit. Make sure the paper is pushed against and touching the base. You can place the top or bottom edge of the paper against the unit without affecting text recognition. Press the large scan button on top of the unit. In only a few short seconds, the Omni Reader has converted the text document into speech. On the top of the unit, towards the right side front edge, there's a play slash pause button. We can press this at any time during reading to pause it in its tracks. Press it again to resume. There's a contrast button located on the left side of the front edge of the control panel. Simply press this with the document on screen to cycle through the available colour modes. I'm able to navigate through the document using the right side scroll wheel. and we can use the left side scroll wheel to zoom in or out whilst reading a document. You can save your documents into the internal memory of the Omni Reader. To access these, go into the Files menu to find your saved documents. From the General Settings menu, we have access to a variety of different options. We can change the reading speed to be faster or slower, we can change the reading voice, of which there are many built in, including American English, British English, French, German, and many, many more. We can change the font style, the font size, and we can choose to add more colour contrast options. The Omni Reader even supports downloading and reading of Bookshare books and NFB Newsline publications. You can read MP3 audiobooks and public domain books, and it even supports common email services such as Gmail and Yahoo Mail meaning you can send and receive emails from the Omni Reader. One of the most impressive things about the Omni Reader is how versatile it is for low vision and for blind users. It has a built-in mode available for low vision and for blind users. For example, when using the low vision profile, the scroll wheel zooms in and out by default. But if you set to the blindness profile, this will change the function of the wheel to increase and decrease the reading speed. Another key feature of the Omni Reader is that it's compatible with braille displays, such as the Freedom Scientific Focus. You can connect the braille display directly to the Omni Reader using a USB connection. Now, what started as a physical document is now fully accessible with my braille display. I'm able to move up or down a braille line using the right nav rocker. I can move up or down in a menu list using the left nav rocker. I can move back in the menu using the left nav mode button and I can play or pause reading when in a document using the right nav mode button. We hope you enjoyed this demonstration of the Smart Reader HD and the Omni Reader. At Sight and Sound Technology we provide help desk support, remote desktop connection and a range of support plans that ensure our customers make the most of their assistive technology purchase from Sight and Sound Technology. To find out more call us on 01604 7980070 or visit www.sightandsound.co.uk
Thank you so much for watching. Take care and goodbye for now.